I'm Dr. Brenda Corcoran from the HSC's National Immunisation Office and today we are telling parents that from December the 1st we have a new improved pneumococcal vaccine which is very good news for parents and their babies. Pneumococcal vaccine protects against what illnesses? Pneumococcal disease causes ear infections, more seriously it can cause pneumonias and most importantly it can cause meningitis. And what sort of an uptake is there in Ireland? It, for the vaccine itself, the uptake should be 95%, but we are at the moment reaching rates of about 93%. We have a little bit more to do. We need to make sure that parents bring their babies for three doses of this vaccine to make sure they're fully protected. And if babies are already going through the vaccine schedule, where does the new version slot in? Babies are already receiving this vaccine at 2, 6 and 12 months and have been doing so since the vaccine was introduced in September 2008. From, t from today we are saying that they will get the new vaccine instead. So the new babies will get the vaccine from when they are two months of age and those babies who reach 12 months will get the new vaccine in addition to having received the old vaccine, giving them more protection. What's different about the new vaccine? The new vaccine contains protection against 13 strains of pneumococcal disease, whereas the old vaccine only contained protection against seven. So we have an extra protection from this new vaccine, which is very good. But there are other vaccines to protect against meningitis also. Yeah, meningitis can be caused by lots of different germs. We also have the MenC vaccine and we have the Hib vaccine that are given routinely to all babies, as well as the pneumococcal vaccine. That protects them against other forms of meningitis. We don't have vaccines to protect fully against all forms of meningitis, so parents still need to be vigilant. The best advice for parents is to make sure their babies get all the vaccines that they should get at the correct times and also to be vigilant if their baby is unwell, if they have any concerns, they should seek medical help. And after a baby has received a vaccine, what advice do you give to parents? After a baby receives any vaccine, most times there's no issues at all. Occasionally they may get a sore arm or be a little bit out of sorts in which case the parents can give them a, some paracetamol or some ibuprofen. Most babies are perfectly okay after that and it's a short term issue. But again, if parents have any concerns, they should seek medical help. Dr. Brenda Corcoran, thank you very much. Thank you.